Hey guys, this is Zinchronize here. Recently I've noticed a lot of Minecraft YouTubers have been releasing item collection and item drop-off points using minecarts. Now, minecart systems, they're really cool now that there's hoppers being released. This isn't actually my system here, I, I don't have a 3x1x3 by by three design, I've got a 3x3 three three design. Sorry, 3x3x3 three by three by three design for you. Now, I've also done a bit of the maths and I've worked out that it's roughly uh, for every item taken, it's roughly, sorry, the number of items taken are the number of stacks in here times 16 times 2.75. So for this one here, it'll be about 40 something, give or take. So let's see exactly what that, I think this one's 46. Yeah. So for stack of gold, you don't have to use gold, you could use cobblestone or whatever. Ender pearls, if you want to. Um, as long as you use a hopper here, chest isn't really needed. It's just for if you're up on the surface and you want easy access at the same height as this. Um, but then again, you wouldn't be able to get them. Out. Never mind. Just ignore that part. Um, so anyway, we've got 46 items here. Now let's say we have tons of items in this. Not in the chest. Sorry. We've got 46 there. Let's. That'll be, yeah, so 46 items for 16 pearls. So one stack times 16. So 1 times 16 times 2.75 is roughly um, 44, which is the results I have with the other systems and stuff. If I place the minecart in here, it will come up to here, and as soon as it gets to 44, it will release it. Now, if I place more items in here, it'll take them out as well. And when the count of items in here becomes less than the count in there, so when this these items reach 44, it'll be less for this, because this counts as a whole stack. But if you've got items like these blocks, um, it'll be less. So this, this trick here only works for um, normal stacking items, like items that stack up to 64. So now we'll just get into showing you how to build it. It's actually a pretty simple design. Um, right. So to start off, you want to place blocks like this, and then some rail on top. You then want to place a comparator here, and then a comparator here. Then on top of this one, you're going to place a... Sorry, on top of this piece of rail, you're going to place a hopper. And then around here, you're going to place another hopper. Now these need to be hoppers, because chests don't seem to read the same way that hoppers do. It must be the number of item slots that it accounts for. Now, this this piece of track is only needed to power this one. Don't use redstone or anything there to be cheap, because it will mess with this comparator here. So you can't use redstone there. So the next thing you want to do is you want to place a block like this then a redstone torch on top of that and then you want to place a piston here and a redstone block on top of that and that's pretty much you done for the thing you maybe want to place a chest sorry, chest, not a trap chest up here and this that will suck the items you can see because I've got nothing in here it just takes it pretty much instantly say if I put 64 in here and 64 Okay, so yeah, get the idea. Okay, so that's pretty much it for this video. Nice little short and very compact design here to match a very short video. Thanks for watching, hope you're able to use this, and I hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.